Let me show you how I uh, remove bluing off of a gun for engraving using muriatic acid. Here's the parts, the blued parts of a gun that I have that I want to strip. This is a bath of muriatic acid available at a hardware store. This is a bucket of water, about a gallon of water with about a cup of baking soda added to it to neutralize the acid. This is regular, just regular tap water as a rinse after the neutralization. This is my WD-40, a little piece of cardboard to lay the parts on, gloves, safety glasses, and here we go. Take the slide, put it right in the acid, You can see the bluing come off of it almost instantly. You can rub the part a little bit to help, or you can uh, get a little brush, swab, to scrub it a little bit to get in all the little spots. Look how the acid's reacting on that metal down there. Now I'm doing this very close to being outside. It's in my garage. Now that's all pretty clean, believe it or not. So we'll take this, put it in, in here to neutralize it. I'll put it in some clean water here to rinse off the salts from the baking soda. I'll set it down here. And let me spray it with some WD-40 as a water displacement. Because remember now, this stuff will... It's bare wet steel. And there you go. It's gone from blued to stripped in just a few seconds. Not difficult. So let's go ahead and grab another part. Here's the frame. See how nice and blued it is? Into the acid it goes. It's almost like magic. And please wear safety glasses. Oops, still a little bit left right there. That's okay. That'll clean right off with a little bit of sandpaper. Now I got it all oiled up, but I don't want to put it back in the acid bath. And that's all there is to it. And the only thing you need to do is go ahead and recover your acid and dispose of your uh, your rinse your rinse of water. And that's it. Not rocket science. Fairly easy. Saves a lot of time.